that. In your bigger stores, you guys like make it in the in a store, and it, that stuff tastes good. It's cheaper too, but this stuff it's too much vinegar. What a loving uh, attrib attrib attribution. I think it's before 8 o'clock and they got the flea market and that's barely readable. So I've been sitting here the past couple hours with just my hood up. Really, no car has been through here. It's very peaceful, but in case, I've seen cops when I was in the library driving through here. Just in case, you know, in that remote possibility that one comes, I want to see how they react. Sun rises in the east, and it looks like it's some kind of a, a Masonic cemetery. It may or may not be open. I'm gonna check it out, but I want to ask about this flag. <laughs> oh. Hey, Hi. yeah, I'm curious about the flag. Who's who put that up? What does it uh, What does it mean? Let's see if I can find some. What? I'll find you any other printout for it. A printout? Yeah. There's like a philosophy behind it. I've never seen that style. So I walk about a mile now to get about a half, about a, over a gallon of water for cooking. All right, so in Sturdivant Park, we got this, this sign. It talks about resources acquired in this area. That's interesting. Hmm. Sounds like we're under attack. Uh, 507. It's pretty alarming. I don't know what to do exactly. I hear this pretty frequently. Maybe this is the big one. I should become a cookbook editor and just erase all the sugar that they say you need to add edit all those stupid cookbooks there's none that are good they always they always want to add sugar to food so this is the jail and the sheriff's office is right here look at this bridge so they'll process the the uh the criminal and the the well oh, well okay this is a courthouse my mistake the sheriff's office is, is also in the courthouse so when the prisoner is ready for sentencing, they'll take him across. He'll walk the bridge. And I'm checking to see if it's open on Martin Luther King Day. <clears throat> Alright. I guess it's closed on Martin Luther King Day. Or at least it's before 9, maybe? So this is a sheriff's office, and it says it's closed. And close for Martin Luther King Day, most likely. So, it's something. 
in observance of the lunch hour I got a lot of read on this uh, sheriff's office okay all right so this bridge is interesting I've never seen anything like that before well I've seen them but not for not for uh, the criminals to get escorted into the the courthouse from the jail <coughs> Probably have a roof over it and everything has to be fully secure, no windows fully secure for just to prevent escape. Oh, there's a law library. I, I think I don't recall seeing that. I'm sure they're closed on Martin Luther King Day as well. <laughs> Juvenile department over there. So it looks like it's downstairs. Just take a peek. Usually they have internet. Okay, yeah, it's all dark. This library, this law library, has no internet, or at least it has a private with a, a security thing. So maybe some people just have to ask. What did they drop here? Master mechanic. So I, I kind of uh, get the impression that maybe they lead the jail people, the people who are imprisoned, uh, over here to do their their. Uh, their research on their cases or something the jailhouse lawyers may have access when they're given the particular privilege because it's really easy uh, walking distance to the 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 legal library you don't you don't see that very often where they have a legal library right next to the <clears throat> right next to the the jail Like when the cops searched my car and left the dog inside their vehicle the whole time I wonder if they might have had marijuana on them ready to plant in my car uh, so that so the dog wouldn't alert on on anybody around my car this is a traditional skill center I'm gonna walk in and just ask what's the deal traditional skills what kind of a business? I bet it's locked. Nope. Hey, excuse me. Uh, who's in charge? Like, wow. What uh, do you like, mean? I don't know. What's this all about? Is this a private or is it like sponsored by grants and stuff? Uh, yeah, we're a nonprofit sponsored yeah. by grants. Mostly. Grants. Okay. Because I heard a chicken, you know, a rooster crowing. So I mean, you guys got a lot going on around here. Yeah, yeah. How do you how do you like explain it? Oh well, we teach traditional skills. Okay, uh, maybe survival skills, maybe primitive survival. That oh, kind of thing. all right. You have like an expert in each uh, category. Yeah. And they they, uh, they set up classes. It'd be like a class. Yeah. Every Sunday. Every Sunday. At eleven. At, at eleven. Mm -hmm. You, you have, how, how many people show up? Uh, it depends. Uh, we range anywhere from 4 to 14. Oh, okay. It keeps it kind of small. And how much do you charge for that? Our classes are free. Okay. Uh, All except right. for the self-defense work that we do. Yeah. Oh, then you charge for your jujitsu? Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. And then uh, just, they, they, uh, they just kind of sign up through the internet or something? Uh, no, they mostly just show up. Um, oh, yeah. All right. Come on in. Oh, sure. Yeah, I see you got a lot of on display mm -hmm. with uh, like old Indian methods and stuff. You got a website? Yeah. Okay. Website and a Facebook. Uh, you can okay. see what we've done in the past. Yeah. What we do. Yeah, this is uh, all right. And then you, you explain it well on the internet. So it's mm -hmm. and this this display kind of gives a really good idea of what's going on, right? Yeah. You got like herbal stuff and yeah. eggs. So you maybe you paint shells and then you, you tie knots. 
make baskets, weave baskets. It's a, I mean, it's all. Yep. Fire, food, shelter, navigation, all yeah. sorts of stuff. Okay. Yeah, that's all right. That's this, uh, and it's a uh, every week. It's different, maybe. Every week it's different. So okay. last week we and you did have a schedule smoking on... meat. Uh, no, we usually decide the week during the week what the okay. next class is going right. to be. And then, uh, based right. on what people have said that they want to do. Okay, and then last week you guys did what? Uh, smoking meat. So with modern smoke, smokers, smoke, smoke with sig- primitive smokers. Yeah, smoke signals or smoking meat. Smoking oh, meat for preservation. Oh, jerking the meat. Yeah. Right. Yeah. How about the week before? Um, week before we did a series on uh, the Arab headscarf, the shamag, and oh, is that all different? of its uses. Is that, is that different from the hijab? Uh, no, well, it's, it, yes, it it's is. a female it's, and uh, male version. Not, not so much. Uh, oh. The shemag is about a, a meter square of material, yeah. um, and it doesn't have uh, any religious significance. Yeah, maybe it keeps the flies out or something. Yeah, yeah, flies and, and sand and heat and. Okay, and that was just yeah, that's just kind of a, a topic yep. that takes some time by itself. Yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. That's that's uh, all right. Well, I was just curious, I yeah, guess, general yeah, picture problem. of what you're doing. Yeah. So, all right, thank you. Have a good day. See you.